take you to Paris Welcome to another vlog. I'm taking a trip out of the UK in two days. I'm so excited for this trip. It's somewhere I haven't been before. Um, I've already done most of the preps. I couldn't film everything because most of them were unplanned. Anyway, so I'm just getting ready to go to the mall. I want to pick up a few things for my trip. And then when I come back, I'll be doing my packing. This is what my room is looking like. These are all the clothes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so these are my clothes. These are most of the clothes that I want to take with me. I've already like paired them up. So it will be easier for me to pack. Even my shoes, everything's under there. I'm all set to go. This is a full look. <laughs> Got my Crocs on. So I just finished eating. Um, I tried to buy my straightener from Boots, but apparently it's more expensive. So I found the same type on Argos. It's the Remington S3500 straightener because the one I have is bad. I need to change it. So I just got back home. I've had something to eat. I've also put some clothes in the wash. Whew, I'm about to start packing my stuff. Anyway, this is the hair straightening i was talking about that i stopped by agos to collect Ooh, crazy stuff so besties i'm all done packing my stuff hey besties what's good so today is the day i'm traveling to paris Flight is in a couple of hours i'm all set to go i'm going through amsterdam just because the Schengen visa I got was for Amsterdam. You either have to go in through the country that you got the visa from or leave through the country that you got the visa from. Let me show you guys what I'm looking like. So I've got my face cap from Nike. I've got my wig from Caitlin. <laughs> this two-piece outfit, I got it from Shein. Very comfy. I'm so in love with the material. I got my Pretend Dior bag. My socks from Asus Collusion. Then I've got my New Balance 530 sneakers. Then I'm going to be putting on my sunglasses from Tom Ford and I'm good to go. So I'm in the Uber now on my way. I changed hats. I changed it to a pocket hat. Actually, oh. oh, we are twinning, eh? If you like to copy me, copy crap. Hey besties, so I've just checked in my bag. I've just been through security as well. Thank God everything was really quick. So yeah. We just stopped to get something to eat. First we got stuff from Burger King and then now I'm at Pizza Lux. Trying to get pizza. Guys, this is the pizza. Two gloves. So I don't have to use my hands to eat and I don't have to look for a place to wash my hands before or after eating. Makes sense, right? Smart girl. Hey besties, so I just arrived in Amsterdam. I'm in Schiphol Airport at the moment and I'm just waiting to pick up my luggage. This was like the fastest air journey I've had in a very long time. It's like I was traveling from London to, no, from Manchester to London. <laughs> Just 
come to the uh, Paris airport. What's this one called? The Charles de Gaulle airport. Um, we're just waiting for Massa to land from Manchester. And then we'll be on our way to the hotel. Sneakers in Paris. Bandru! So your girl just had a shower. When I got into the room, I was so tired. <laughs> really tired. I think it was because of the whole journey from yesterday up until today. I didn't even have the energy to go out to get some lunch. Um, I tried to sleep but I couldn't as well because I was doing some editing. Um, I'm about to go have dinner and I'm just about to do my makeup. I'm going to a place called Uber Mama. So um, it's been hyped on TikTok. I want to go and see what the hype is about. The girl is all done. <laughs> this is what I'm looking like. <laughs> this is the fastest makeup I've done in my entire life. So I've got my your earrings on. I've got this black dress and I've got my little purse. My black dress, my sister just asked me, it's from PLT. Why is my lip looking like this? Mm. Okay, but yeah, we're rushing, we're quite late that's the look so we're on our way now say hello <sighs> Hey besties, so I just got back home, tired, I had so much fun on day one, I really enjoyed my food at Uber Mama, it was worth the hype, honestly, 10 out of 10, it was so nice, the truffle pasta, I even had um, a taste of the food my sister was having and puppy, and it was really good as well, properly cooked, and the cocktail, a mocktail, don't even get me started on it. But yeah, day one in Paris, done and dusted, on to day two. Hey besties, good morning. So it's day two in Paris, bonjour. <laughs> okay, so today I'm going to the Eiffel Tower and then we're also doing like a boat cruise around Paris. The weather is not bad, it's sunny, hopefully it's not very windy. For the Eiffel Tower we already rebooked and paid so we've got our tickets and our phone even for the boat cruise as well because someone said it's better for you to um, pre-book. I'll leave all the link in the description in case you're interested. Hey besties, oh my gosh, I don't know if you guys can see me, I can't see myself. The sun is burning my face. Let me go under. <laughs> okay. Yeah, better. So, we're ready to go. This is me. And this is my sister. We're tweeting. <laughs> she like the look. <laughs> we just got to our bus stop. Eiffel. To Eiffel. So we're taking a walk now, and it's two minutes from there to the Eiffel Tower. We're on a queue now, we're waiting to go up the tower. You don't want pictures? 
Because you're very beauty. Hey besties, so um, my sister's put the um, Eiffel Tower tour for 26th, which is tomorrow instead of 25th. So we got there and the ticket won't work, it didn't let us go in. There's a warning to you all, <laughs> when you're booking your ticket, make sure you get the right date. Please, if you're ever in France and you happen to visit the Eiffel Tower, do not play this game. When you see people win, it's just part of the plot to make you think it's legit. It's a total sham and scam. My sister and I lost $200. Just on our way now to get on the boat for our boat cruise. It's just three minutes walk from the Eiffel Tower. So if you're trying to go on the Eiffel Tower, it's better for you to book the boat cruise as well, just so um, it's easier for you to commute. And it's just, it's a really nice experience to be fair. I'm having a really good time. Guys, we have like a very clear view of the Eiffel Tower from the boat. It's looking really good. We just stopped by this French place to get something to eat. It's called Grill Istanbul. And this is what we're having. It's called Mix. It's very close to the hotel. There's the one there. This is nice. Hey besties, your girl is back to the hotel and <laughs> my guys, I am so 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 tired. I've had a very 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 busy day. So many <laughs> walks to different places. My feet is hurting. Um, I just want to shower and sleep. There's a game I posted. If you come to Paris, don't even think about playing that game. It's a scam for real for real. Don't play it. You would think you know the game so much, you think you're gonna win it, but you won't. Trust me. And the people that are there that look like they're winning, they're part of the whole plot. It's a scheme. My sister is calling me. What can I do for you? You called me. When did I call you? I called you since, I think. Nice. I'm talking to my besties. Look at it. Hi besties, uh, today we're actually going out uh, back to the Eiffel Tower and hopefully we won't lose $200 today, promise, finger crossed. <laughs> Hi besties, so it's day three. <laughs> I don't know, I've lost track, uh, but I think it's day three. I'll check. We're going back to Eiffel Tower because we couldn't go in yesterday and then we'll go to um, Avenue Montaigne. The streets where they have so many um, designer stores Gucci, Bottega, Fendi, Louis Vuitton, so many, so many. So, yeah, this one looking like. So we're back here at the Eiffel Tower where we 
on the line and we're just waiting for the elevator to come so we can go upstairs. So on the top, second floor now, and you can literally see almost the whole of Paris here. It's so good. So we've gone up the Eiffel Tower, we're down, we just used the restroom. We want to go to um, the streets where they have all the luxury shops and then we'll go to the museums. Yeah. So we just got off the um, train station, going to the Louvre Museum. Banana, um, strawberry. Banana. And coconut. Are you look what? No, no, no. no? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Guys, we're here at the Louvre. So beautiful. Oh wow, this is so nice. So nice. So we just ordered food from an African kitchen. This is what we ordered. So I got turkey, stew with assorted meat, rice, jollof fries, you know, and just something to keep the body and soul together. Okay, bye. Hey besties, so it's officially day four in Paris. It's gradually coming to an end, but it's all right. It's time to go back and hustle. Anyway, today we're going to Disneyland. We're all set to go. I'm all dressed up. Hey guys, so we're outside the hotel now. We're on our way to Disneyland. We can't wait. Hey besties, so we just got to Disneyland. Peace. 
Andrew. So it's day five in Paris, and today we're going back to Manchester. We've checked out of our hotel room. We're just sat in the hotel lobby, um, waiting for time to pass, and then we'll be on our way to the airport. My hand is still hurting, but it's not as bad as it was yesterday. Party. <laughs> Speak to you when I get to the airport, okay? Hey besties, your girl is at the airport. Um, we've checked in. We've checked in our stuff and we're about to board now, so we just stopped by this place called Pals Junior to get something to eat. Vacation is over. <laughs> so yeah, it's called Carl's Jr. I want to get chips and some stuff. That's the menu. 